For 2014, the main focus is, of course, the Reline. It's the biggest capital project that Aslamital South Africa has undertaken in over six years. We estimate the total cost will be 1.6 billion rand, and this includes refurbishment and work that needs to be done to ancillary plants, to the blast furnace, such as the raw material handling plant, the center plant, and various other projects where, because we do have such a long shutdown, there's a window of opportunity that happens once in 20 years to undertake those, those uh, maintenance projects. During the reline, we are going to supply our domestic customers uh, for it. So. And if you look historically at the domestic dispatches from Newcastle, you will end up with something like 100,000 tons a month uh, for all products. And since we have foreseen a four month reline period, 125 days, um, the stocks should be sufficient. Should the market pick up, we will be able to get additional material from Feenigink and from um, Vanderbilt Park where we can uh, slit slabs to uh, put them into the Newcastle loading mills. So we have some, some plans, but we think, first instance, that what we're putting on the ground is sufficient. We assume that um, the blast furnace, when it is relined and and we're getting a better stability because of the improved uh, technique. Uh, we assume that the, the blast furnace goes along with probably something like uh, 25 kilograms less of uh, uh, solid fuel consumption, which would then uh, lead for the hot metal to a saving at current, uh, at current cost levels of around uh, 12 to 15 dollars per ton. Capacity will be slightly increased. Um, um, we are seeing that furnace uh, today at a capacity of 1.7 uh, million tons and after the reline it will be at 1.9.